Okay, I give him a fire command. He's going to shoot his um, anti-tank weapon at the armored car and his machine gun at the guys behind him. But first he has to pass his leadership test. Greetings, and welcome to Halfling 13 Gaming. And welcome to our premiere episode of our Bolt Action 3rd Edition Battle Reports. Bolt Action is a new game for us, though I've always been interested in historical settings. With the release of 3rd Edition, I felt it was time to dip my toes in the water, see how well we liked the game. George was my eager companion to test out the new mechanics. As always, if you spot any errors, please leave a comment to help us and other players learn. Since this was our first time playing, despite reading the rules multiple times and watching numerous videos, there are a lot of errors. It's true that no plan survives the chaos of reality. However, the rules themselves are otherwise straightforward, quick to pick up. Most of our issues were with Star Wars Legion bias and habit, or just general unfamiliarity. Our starting force is the Gentleman's War starter set, which brings a balance and even force to both sides. Officially released for second edition, one advantage of the game, given real world units, is that models do not become obsolete with the new edition. So I found them completely compatible with the new edition army tools. Given the forces, we're of course fighting in, North Af in the North Africa theater with the British facing off against the German army. As usual, gray objects and rocks provide heavy cover with a few scattered pieces of light cover Though for the game, everything seemed to be heavy cover. You will note that obviously none of our models are painted as of yet. They've been primed, but don't have any color. I hope to correct that soon, now that we have a game of experience. If you have any suggestions or additional units to bulk up both forces, leave us a comment down below for your suggestions. For the Germans, George is fielding a single rifle platoon and an armor platoon. The rifle platoon has its platoon commander, a pair of hair infantry squads, a light armor team, and an anti-tank team. The armor platoon, platoon I don't think is technically legal since we only have one vehicle, but it's fielded in an SDKFZ-222 light armored car as the command unit. The Germans have 443 points with six order dice. The British are almost exactly the same composition due to the starter set, with the same rifle platoon and armor platoon combination. The only substantial difference is the armored car, which is a Mark IV Humber armored car. The British also have 443 points and six order dice. Quite a few assumptions were made in the creation of the army list, and we ended up with a couple of men being short on each of the each of the units. So in the game, there's so, there are some adjustments. As always, we welcome our viewers, both past and present. All 3D models you use are available either on Thingiverse or from various companies. Please check the description for details. We're using a custom design clip-on unit designation, I refer to as a war game widget, which helps separate the units, especially when they're all just prime or white. If you're interested, those are available in our Etsy shop, or the design is available to our Patreon sponsors. If you enjoy this content, drop a like on the video or to help grow the audience, and subscribe to the channel to be notified for future releases. Consider supporting us directly by joining our channel with the YouTube join icon located next to the subscribe, or consider our other Patreon options. Leave us a comment to let us know what you did or did not like about this battle or the video format. We're eager to engage with the audience and improve the channel. Your support and feedback is appreciated and helps us continue creating content. New Bolt Action videos will typically be posted on Saturdays, though it may be infrequent to start. Um, so I got these dudes. Okay. Um, we're going to... Come back. Okay, deploy up there with a the run. Yep. Okay, put the other guys there, and then you just put the run dice next to it. Okay. Okay, I'm going to issue a run maneuver to my first guys. Who will run onto the board. And position themselves behind the... Okay, I got a second dice for the dice, which is going to be another run. Run, run some guys up there. Hide behind, hide beside the building over here. Okay, so for the next dice, blue, I will guess I take it in advance. And I'm going to go up the hill to where at the edge there. And that will be these guys. Oh, no. We're moving. Um, I believe we're guessing. We're still due to this game. After the advance order, they can shoot. So they're going to shoot from the hill at the red squad over there. Missed. Okay. Next. Do I get a pin token? 
Uh, yes, because I should got issued the shot at you. Yeah, I'm going to deploy my mortar team just here on the edge of the board, and with an advance order, I guess, wherever that went, and then they will take a shot. That's something I wanted to ask. Did they do they need line of sight? No, they have indirect fire. Uh, and this is where I need a six to hit. Do not. Okay. So what we do is we put one marker next to them. And then next time I get plus one and then plus two, etc. until I hit them. Okay, I'm gonna draw another blue token. That's going to be my commander. He's going to run. Up to the building over here. Take some cover behind the rocky shed. Okay. Um, these guys are going to advance to there, and then shoot at those guys. Okay. So. So it's so it's nineteen. So it's just the rifles and light machine gun. Okay. Okay. Pull out all the fives. Four. Mm -hmm. And then you roll to damage. One. One. Okay. And I have soft cover or hard cover. And it has to be half the unit or more. Similar to other games. So... Hard? Sure. Okay. For the building, hard cover is a four plus save. Building blocks it. Okay. Okay. And I get a pin marker. Okay. Get some mortar right there with the advance, and then it's going to shoot at the same squad. Okay. Same one over here? Yep. Okay. Yep. yep. Okay. The armored car advanced onto the board, and he's going to take a shot at the mortar over there. So first I'll roll the six uh, medium machine gun. And I need fives. Scoring five. And those need your regular, so I need fives to wound. No, fours to wound. Okay. Three wounds. And then you have heavy cover, so you have a four plus save. Okay, so they're both dead ends. Okay, that's it. That, um, no, that's sorry, that's cover save. And then I have, I rolled damage. Yeah, that's it. That's, okay. That just wipes them out. So these guys are going to advance right there. Um, so we'll advance right there, okay. and then shoot the tank. Okay, return fire at the tank. Yep. Okay. okay. Um, so, uh, there -ish with it. Okay. And then shoot at the thing. Okay. And then, in that case, I won't go as far. Okay. I mean, I'll keep the move because that's where I moved, but. Back up just a little bit. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. No, I, 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 I don't know the game any better yeah. than you, so I'm just going based on what what we're playing. Right here. Um, they will simply advance and then take shots at the same squad of dudes. These guys. Yep. Yeah. You roll one. Yep. Okay. You're batting a thousand here. I'm going to tell this unit of regular riflemen to advance. They're going to roll their leadership, scoring a nine, which is not going to be sufficient. So that's going to fail. So they're going to go down instead and take cover. Um, these guys are going to shoot at the light vehicle. Right, with a fire command. You need a four better to hit instead of a five. Nope. Okay. 
So it does. Pins it though. Okay, then you should have a second pin then. Okay. Next dice. Okay. That's all you. Yep. Um, so this is going to go, um, going to go over to like here, I guess. Okay. And then shoot at the thing. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Two dice, need fives. Nope. Nope. <laughs> okay. I give him a fire command. He's going to shoot his, um, anti-tank weapon at the armored car and his machine gun at the guys behind him. But first he has to pass his leadership test, which is a 12, which is bad, because I think he just fled. He said, enough of this. He's off the board. Okay. Okay. And these guys are just going to fire at those guys. Okay. Three rifle shots. Need fours. Yeah, two good, two good hits. Uh, well then, three good hits. <laughs> Okay. So you need uh, four to wound me. One. One wound. I have a cover save. You got plus two on the cover I, save. I got plus two. So I need a base four. So I need a two or better. Got it. Okay. So another point of pin. Yeah. These guys are going to go over here. You need fives. Yeah. Right there on that one, I guess. Yeah, six up. And four's a wound. Uh, three of them. Three of them. And I need five saves. Why five? Five plus. Okay. Getting three of them. There you go. Okay. Another point of pin. Okay. That's right. They're going to be completely panicked. Okay. I gave an order to my platoon leader who grabbed another order to snap to with these guys. I'm going to start with these, and they're going to advance. If you can measure six inches for me. Which one's the leader? Uh, the guy here in the front with the submachine gun. Sure. He's going to advance out to here. And then they'll take a shot at the guys back there in the cover. And I need five to hit you. Around four. Scoring four, three wounds. So then cover. Cover is four plus for heavy cover. And you don't have an order. You can go down if you want. Technically, you should, we should have declared that as soon as I declared the attack. So it's That's up to fine. you if you yeah. want to do it. Don't worry about it. Okay, so four plus. Two guys dead. Okay. I think that's the first actual casualty other than a full unit we've had. Yeah. And a pin. My leader will advance just around the side of the building and then take a shot at the Green squad over there. One hit. One wound. And then do I have cover? 
because of the is it is it based off intermediate cover or is it based I off think the, so okay so four plus One cough drop for you. Okay, I'm going to issue a fire order up here for this anti-tank who's going to fire away over there at the armored car. Nope. Next. Those guys. Okay. Um, so these guys are going to attempt to fire at those guys. Okay. And the goals get below. You have a base nine minus three is six, and you're not within six inches of your leader, so six. I got three total. Well then, I guess you get to shoot. Okay. And you remove one point of a pin. I'm shooting submachine guns and light machine guns. Okay. So four is ahead. Mm-hmm. So a lot of them. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And then you need force to wound. So nine hit. Okay. Three. Three? Yeah. That wasn't so good. So three of them, and I don't think I have cover. Oh, I have intervening terrain, which is what we're saying is cover. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So three uh, three cover saves. There you go. Okay. So we are firing very ineffectively at each other. I have to get pinned, which seems to be stacking up a lot really fast. Mm -hmm. We're just going to take another fire action and shoot back to the same unit, needing a five this time. Nope. So change that one to a two. Next time I need a four. Okay. And they're pinned. Nope. I don't have the four pinned. Okay. This unit is getting a rally order which our understanding means it uses their normal leadership of nine plus two for the captain or lieutenant or platoon leader, whatever it is. So 11 or better or worse, lower. There you go, success. So they clear everything and they're done. Issue another fire order to this guy. He is going to shoot his recoilless rifle way over there at the car again. Then. Yes. Okay. okay, so it does D6 plus two penetration. And you need seven or better to affect vehicles, at least armor cars. Seven or eight. Yep. Okay, okay, fine. Blew a large hole out of the building though. You can put it in your marker next to it. I could. Up here and shoot at those guys some more. Okay. Five. Nothing. Okay. So never pin. Then these guys go forward here. And we're going to shoot those guys. So five. And then it's fours or five. fours or wound. Um, two. two, two wounds, and then four plus cover save for the wall. Scoring one. Okay. And that 
I failed it. Aha! So let's rewind right. that. My guy comes back. Yep. And you're still back. You're still there. There. We're going to take a fire order and fire at the same unit. So mortar, that's going to hit this time. Okay. So that's now going to go to a five on the attack or a four on the attack. So it's maxed out. And then I can hit, I get one hit for every guy under a one inch ruler. So we'll go four. So I guess we'll go ahead and do the down things. I know that has extra benefits against. Okay. So you're going to go down. So technically, I, I mean, again, I'm not really worried about it. That's when, when I declare the attack, I issue the order. Okay. You, you're supposed to do that. So, but I don't really care about it. So you go down. So that goes next to it, ties up their order. Yep. So I get four guys. And you don't get cover because it's coming from above, mm -hmm. mechanically. And if you hit a vehicle with it, they have an extra penalty on their armor. Um, and it's a four plus to wound. Get done. Okay. Okay. I get another marker. You do. You get another pin. Activated my platoon leader. He's going to snap two with these guys. Yeah, he does not have a, have that. So he's going to. He'll go first with his advance, and assuming he's within range, he's moving up to this window here. Sure. So he'll go up to there. And then they'll shoot through the window at the guys that are in here. So four at point blank. I got two two hits. These both missed. And then wounds for one. Okay. And just kills the guy. Okay. So you don't get any cover save this time. Don't you technically get to choose the dude? No. 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 Okay, you were saying previously. If you have a sniper, they have special rules where you can pick out the model that you can kill. Okay. And the model in that case absolutely matters. Okay. These guys are going to take their leadership. They have a nine normal. They have an eight currently. Failing that. So they're going to go down. Um, these guys are going to... Ish. And shoot at them, I guess. So I'm have line of sight. I think I do. Okay. So five. Nope. Okay. Yeah. So you get their pinned. Sure. They are now pinned. Don't have enough tokens. Um, we haven't run out yet. We're about to. Maybe. Okay, so this dude. I have to roll first. Okay. Eight. Eight. With the leadership is nine minus two is a seven. Okay. So they go. They're just going down instead. Yeah. There's no one in the front. Yeah. So we try this. And a seven. Oh, got it that time. Okay. So it's it's so if it's equals it's good? Yep. So you remove one. Okay. So it's advancing. Okay. There you go. There. there. And then shooting at those guys. Shoot those guys. So, so you need a five with the cannon. Nope. Okay. Uh, so one. One. Okay, so four to hit, or four to wound. Yep. And I don't have any cover here, so one guy did. That's probably a time when I should have gone down. More is going to go. It's going to fire another shell into the same unit over here. You want to go down or just take it? Yeah, I'll go down. Okay. Two to hit. Got him. So we said four guys. Yep. 
going to wound one. Okay, and then so I have a five plus save. Well, it does. <coughs> it does something different because it's indirect. Is it? Yeah. Okay. What does it do? Um. Number of hits suffered is halved. Okay, so still one. Okay. I only rolled one hit. Oh, so. yeah. That's probably more effective. Maybe. Okay. Do you still do you get a cover save or does um, it just reduce the hits? I mean, I'll look at it. Um, it says it has it gets no cover, and then if the target is down. So I, I assume I still take the damage. I okay, so I think you take one guy then. Okay. That that would make my more sense to me other than you get a cover save plus half the damage. Yeah. Shoot my um, commander a fire order to shoot at the guys in cover that are already down. They have to roll for their order. Scoring a four, which will be enough. So two hits, one wound. Okay. One more guy dead. Okay. And another point of pin. Okay. So these guys are going to advance over to here and shoot at them. So one. Yep. One dead. Are you cover, don't you? Okay. Yep. Okay. Another point of pin. I think we might be over heavy on the cover. Because everything is having cover. Or it's just, we're just used to it with the, the other games. Maybe. These guys are going to advance over here. And then shoot those guys. Okay. Instead, I'm going to shoot the rifles at them and then the other other two guns. These guys. The machine guns. Yeah. Sub -machine, sub machine guns at them. Sub machine gun, light machine gun. Machine gun. Okay. Rally. No okay. problem. Um, so one. And nothing. So okay. Then. Goals. I uh, got two. One, two. And then two cover. Okay. Okay. So now they're just pinned. Yep. This unit will attempt to fire. They're going to shoot at the green squad. Unsuccessfully. So they just go down. These guys will take a fire action, shooting at the remnants of the Red Squad. Failing as well. They will go down. These guys are going to fire at the other crew. I hit something. You did? Woo! And then wound? Uh, you got two guys because I think it's explosive, isn't it? Rifle team. No, it's not. I at least mine so. is not. Mine isn't. Okay, so one guy. Got him. Okay. Cover. Okay. Nope. I only have a minus one to hit. And because they lost half their team, they have to make an immediate rally check? I'm fine with that. I don't know if it applies okay. on the weapon crews. I don't know. But we can check. I will roll just in case. Okay. Oh, they failed, so I guess it, it depends on the rule. If the target loses half or more of its models, um, single unit then makes a morale check. Um, okay, don't worry about it. We'll count it as yes. Having failed their rally check, uh, that unit is eliminated. Let us know if that's wrong. Um, so I issued them an order, um, and then these ones 
Um, so we'll do do these guys first. Okay. Um, they're just going to shoot at those guys. They're going to fire there. Yep. Okay. Yeah, three. Uh huh. I got two. And you have cover. Two dead. These guys are going to rinse and repeat what they did last round. Um, the machine gun shooting at them and the rifle shooting at them. That's a good hit. That's a wound. Two. Two. Cover saves, no. No. Okay, both dead. And then... Uh, one. Yep. So it just did that. Okay. And then the vehicle. Okay. Who's, who's going to shoot at? Where's um, he he's advancing. Okay. The vehicle is going to go like this. And then shoot at them. Oh, fun. He'll roll and got it off. Okay. He's just First, I'll do the AP, I guess. Sure. <laughs> um, so yes. both missed on those, so you don't have to deal with that. Okay. And then five. Machine gun. We got you on two. Okay. Uh, one on the wound. Okay, so one guy dead. Okay, issuing a fire order to the mortar team again. They're going to lob another one into the guys over here. You gonna go down or take yeah, it? I'll take it. Two or better. Got them. So three guys. Yep. Got one. Yeah. One guy dead. So is that your loader or your NCO? Um your officer or your loader? I'll have it as the loader, I guess. Okay. okay so I got them. I'm going to rally. Um, and I got two. Which clears everything, regardless. Okay. And that's them. Okay. I will fire with this squad, ordering them to shoot at those two guys over there. And the, the leadership is a six. There you go. Which is going to be a success. They're going to get to shoot. Scoring a passable roll. Uh, five. Followed by four wounds. Okay. Cover. There you go. <laughs> Saved the ball. You get another pin. Yep. You have all of them. Okay. Here is going to attempt to advance. I need to find some dice. Give me those two dice. They're going to attempt to advance. Scoring a six, which is not going to be good enough. So instead, they go down. And these guys are going to shoot at that squad over there. Hit him. Damage, nope. So okay. Just a pin. Okay. So that would take us to turn six. Oh, four, five, or six, it ends. Five. So that's good. Okay. <laughs> I'll call this a German victory. Oh. <laughs> At the end of the game, the British forces were being overrun. 
Without anti-tank capabilities, the German, German armored car was quickly cut in through the front lines with the infantry pouring in behind. Despite the early successes, the British forces had lost the day and were forced to retreat from the field. Thank you for watching this video to the end. If you made it this far, please consider a like on the video or subscribe to be notified for future content. Leave a comment for the players to ask why an option was or was not taken, and join the discussion with any advice and tactics for either force to make them more viable in the game.